So that's the dream, huh? I mean, what's money got to do with it? You seem happy. Yeah. I mean, I see what you're saying. It doesn't pay much, but I like it. I suppose it'll depend on the woman I marry, I think. You know, maybe she'll want a bigger house or a better car or a bunch of kids. College doesn't come cheap, you know? I don't know. Wow. So you just give up everything you want for the woman you'd marry? You know what? Yeah, I would. Absolutely. Yeah? Gladly. Because we all make our own decisions, you know? Say you and I, if we were married, for example, just for example, I want to give you what you need. I'm talking about taking care of each other the best you can. I mean, what's wrong with taking care of a woman? She takes care of you. I have a hard time finding a woman like that these days. Shoot, you think so? Mm -hmm. I don't know. Lightning could strike. I gotta go. I take care of my grandma and she'll be wondering where I am, so. Yeah. Hey, listen, did I say something wrong? No. No, I just... Are you sure? You're so right, it scares me. That's all. Yeah, listen, I... I don't want you to be my doctor. I don't want you to examine me and... Why? Because I like you so much. I don't want to examine you. You don't? Why not? Because I like you so much. Oh boy, okay. Okay, now I really gotta go. Yeah, yep. Understood. Alright. Okay. <laughs> Alright. Bye. Goodbye. Wow! Woo! <laughs> I can't believe Mr. Capelli still lives in his pizza shop. I know. Oh, I knew we did break in. So? It wasn't the first time. Yeah, so I doubt he ever <laughs> forgot us. <laughs> I know I never did. Oh. Yes, you did. Why didn't you call me, text me, anything? Why? It wasn't over for me, I waited for you. You left for Iraq and I didn't hear anything. I waited every day. I cried every day. And now, now it's too late. 
What are you talking about? Grace, I called you every day. I, I texted you every day. Hell, I wrote to you every day. I tried my best for a whole year. I never gave up. Truth is, you got me through that war. It was you. It was always you. You did? Yeah. And it still is. You got my letters. Finally. What about my texts and my phone calls? I mean, how did this happen? I don't know. I mean, the letters were hidden. Your number was blocked. Someone blocked your number on my phone. Sounds like someone didn't want us together. I thought it was my sister. Bitch always hated seeing me happy. Are you okay? No. I'm lost. Well, we're here now. What are you gonna do, Grace? I, I don't know. Is that where we are? Are we back there? What about the last couple of days? Huh? I mean, they happen, you know? I know that they happen. Look, they were wonderful, but they were also very irresponsible. I have a fiance at an Airbnb waiting for me. Who's gonna be crushed when he finds out? So what, you make love to me and then you go back to your fiance? I mean, wh what is this, a, a test I didn't pass? No, I made a promise to a man. I, he gave me a ring and I gave him my word. Well, I think your word is about fuck now, don't you think? I, I don't know, but I'll find out when I talk to him. Grace, this isn't about keeping your promise. This isn't about following your heart. This is about security. What are you talking about? He's got a lot of money. Now I hate you, you smug bastard. I hate you. I hate you if you leave here. If you leave here, I hate you. Haven't you been paying attention to anything that's happening? <sighs> I guess not. I guess I must have misread those signals. Yeah, I guess you did. You're bored. Grace, you're bored and you know it. You wouldn't be here if there wasn't something missing. <laughs> you arrogant son of a bitch! Would you just stay with me? Please. Stay with you? Why? What for? Look at us, we're already fighting. That's what we do. We fight. You tell me when I'm being an arrogant son of a bitch, and I tell you when you're being a pain in the ass, which you are 99% of the time. Look, Grace, I ain't afraid to hurt your feelings. You've got like a two second rebound rate, and you're right back to doing the next pain in the ass thing. So what? So it's not gonna be easy. This is gonna be really hard. But I wanna do that, because I want you. I want you forever, 
every day for the rest of my life. Grace, you're the first person that ever made me feel like I mattered. Would you do something for me? Would you just picture your life 30, 40 years from now? What does that look like? Grace, if it's with him, go. I lost you once, I think I could do it again. But if it's not, don't you dare take the easy way out. What easy way? There is no easy way. No matter what I do, somebody gets hurt. Damn it, Grace, will you stop thinking about what everyone else wants? What do you want? Stop thinking about what I want, what your sister wants, what he wants, what your mom wants. What do you want? It's not that simple. God damn it, Grace, what do you want? It's not. It's no. Not.